Hi, everyone, and welcome to Smart Culture Education. This is the place where we make learning simple, clear, and engaging. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you can join us on this journey of mastering maths, science, and more. Here I have some ammonium dichromate crystals. Take a close look. They are bright orange in color and have a crystalline texture. These crystals are our starting material for this experiment. I'm taking about two spatulas of the ammonium dichromate and placing them in the center of a piece of aluminium foil. Next, I make a small hollow in the middle of the heap. This will be the spot where I'll add a few drops of ethanol to help ignite the reaction. I now add a few drops of ethanol into the hollow and light it carefully. The ethanol starts to burn, providing the heat needed for the decomposition reaction to begin. As the reaction proceeds, you can see the bright orange crystals start to glow and give off sparks. The orange color slowly changes to a dark greenish black substance. This happens because the ammonium dichromate decomposes when heated. It breaks down to form chromium oxide, which is green, along with nitrogen gas and water vapor. The changing color shows that a new substance has been formed. The glowing and sparks are a result of the heat and energy released. This is an exothermic reaction. Now that the reaction is complete, we can compare the original orange ammonium dichromate with the greenish black residue formed. You can clearly see the difference in color and texture. The new substance is lighter, fluffy and dark green in color, showing that a chemical change has taken place. This demonstrates a thermal decomposition reaction as one compound has broken down into simpler products and it also involves redox changes. Chromium has been reduced from positive 6 to positive 3 and the ammonium ions have been oxidized. So the decomposition of ammonium dichromate is an excellent example of both a decomposition and a redox reaction. The color and texture changes clearly show that a new substance has formed and the heat and sparks show that energy has been released. Thank you for watching today's video on Smart Culture Education. If you found it helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. And if you want to stay updated, tap the notification bell so you never miss our next lesson. See you in the next video.